What's up ladies and gentle peeps? Today I got my nails done. What gentle peeps? <laughs> I just made it up. Just go with it. We are setting up our podcast section. We started this new segment on YouTube where we're going to do a podcast. And Danny and I were sitting at our setups. Dude, I can't but... Allie, like... Well, that, you yeah. got to remember your fiance is 6'4". You four. were in the back. This is going to be the corner where we're going to be doing our podcast. I need to adjust some things still up because I do think these chairs are a little too close to one another. But again, we'll figure it out. I have an idea of the mic arcs coming from the center out and you can have it here so you still have a clean sight from where the camera and the stand would be. I did get some Go V floodlights for both sides so that we can have, you know, Alex had to be purple, my seat is blue, whatever we decide that day. I got a cart and I'll bring you over there right now because I know Alex set the camera down here so I'm just gonna bring it with me. Wait, okay. oh, your head's out. Why do you have to be so tall? Amazon purchases. We have a nice little cart about this size yay hi the computer's gonna go on the bottom shelf uh, the roadcaster pro 2 is gonna go on top of the keyboard mouse all these little odds and ends to again complete this podcast setup it's all gonna be on a little roll around cart so when we're not using it we can actually put it away is that the same elgato arms that you use in your setup no those are completely different those are boom arms what's the difference that you can like move them around up and down and both arms move. I'm gonna let you know, mine moves up and down, left and right, so. Trust me, you're gonna be like, oh, these are nice. Oh, I nice. Um, so we got a little power strip with USBs on there as well for charging stuff. And I was thinking about even using one of our portable monitors as a monitor instead of the big TV, we'll see. Well, cables, I got 15 foot aux cables, a couple XLR cables, 15 footers. Cause again, on this Procaster, we're going to be running our XLR mics as well as our headphones. So we need to have the, like those extensions so we can hear and communicate, right? Light bars, these are gonna go behind our seats to kind of give both of our sides our own little theme. Alex, I assume will be purple. I don't know what mine's gonna be just yet. Um, you can be purple too if you want. No, but that defeats it. I think it's cool, like boom, boom, you know? I have the camera arm, the quick disconnect plate for the Sony camera that's in my gaming room. We're gonna be using that same camera here. We are unboxing this little cart. Yeah. Does it go with the feng shui of our house? Probably not. God damn it. You have wood Oh no, okay, that's not bad. It's just black. Yeah. Did you read the dimensions before you did it? Yeah, I'm not like you. You almost whack yourself in the face. Allie has a history of ordering things off of line and not knowing how big they are. Like she'll order some flour, right? And then it'll come up and it'll be like a 10 pound bag. And then she'd be like, I didn't know. I didn't. If I would have known, do you think I would have ordered that? Are you nervous for me going away? A little bit. Why? I'm going to be so hungry. I told you I was going to prepare all food before I go. I'm so hungry. In little individual containers. I'm be so hungry. Friday night, so long, all day Saturday, long. and I'll be back Sunday for dinner. What is? You're going to be back Sunday? Yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah, I told you. So you're going to have to stream during the day to get the pick up from the airport. You're an Uber. <gasps> I'm joking. Oh I'm my like, God. I, we're doing finger type first, bubble girl. And then once everything's in place, I will let you Alan key the shit out of everything. Yeah, baby. I think that's pretty nice. Yeah, not half bad, right? Yeah. Baby girl, you make me say ooh. The truth does it fit under? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you talk? I can't. I hope it doesn't fit because all you do is yell me about not measuring. I think it's gonna be absolutely perfect. I told you we should have put the top on after. It should have fit without the top. You think? Yeah. Oh my god, could the top? Think, 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 Danny. Think. Because I, I pre-measured. I did this work. Boom. 20 and a half. And then this is 20. Ooh. But I measured and I looked at the picture. Maybe the picture live. Mm. I feel like you should owe me 20 bucks. Allie, it's like owing yourself 20 bucks. It's the same <laughs> money. It's like, you want to say you have another 20 dollars? Sure. Mm. I don't know like this. <laughs> Fuck. 
This is Danny's old PC. It has a 2080. 2080. 2080. And last time we were cleaning it, we broke the fan that goes here. So we are reinstalling this AER RGB2 fan. This orientation with the wire coming this way. Pass this through. Working on my lefty. Your, your left hand's strong too. <laughs> that was my right one. <laughs> Peter's in. What I think I'm gonna end up doing is unscrewing this side where the power button is, because I'll be able to just lift it a little, click the button, and then put it back down. Okay. So this is the Rodecaster Pro 2. This is the sound interface we're gonna be using for our podcast, which is nice about this thing. It can go up to four inputs and four outputs. So if we end up having two extra guests at some point, I don't want to restrict ourselves by not having the ability to have guests in the setup. My new grandma nails boot. Can I touch it? Mm -hmm. Like that? These don't even press. Are they that like yeah. easy to- Yeah, you just touch them. No. Yeah. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Freaky, 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 freaky Friday. Are you keeping this box? 100%. Oh my lantos. Buy something for 700 bucks and then you get rid of the box. Why? Because it's a box that you're not going to use. Oh. Next week decide that you hate podcasts, Allie. You never want to do one ever again in your life. I would like to have that box to put it in and make it look presentable and put it on Facebook Marketplace and sell it for 500 bucks. Or you could just return it back to the original owner. Amazon. Not okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. <laughs> I saw these headphone clip-on things on Amazon for your desk, and I decided to use them as what I'm going to hook all my extra cables for, like my headphones and for the XLR cables or mics uh, when not using them. So the process is going to be something like something like that, and then I can hang the wires on here. Oh, that's smart. You want to hang it on the back. Well, my plan was to get a camera arm that allowed me to move it wherever I needed it. Um, my plan is to hook it to this same cart and have everything attached to this cart so when I'm not using it, I can roll it into a room or a closet that I don't see it. Now we're mounting the camera. It's a clip on to here and then you can add as many extensions as you want. So the whole point is that you can make it high, low, left, yeah, right. Or even come towards whoever you want or away from the table, whatever I have to do, boom, and just tighten. Spin into the previous, right? And then- Lock it. Locks. Have to go this way with it, and then the next one go this way, you can. I also bought this quick release plate from Newer. This is the same one that I'm using in my gaming setup, so it allowed me to then quickly remove my camera from the gaming setup and move it to this setup by just snapping it in. Top plate is already attached to my camera. So all I need to do is attach this to this area here, and then I'll be able to snap right in place. I'm using my same camera on both setups, my podcast and my gaming setup. And very easily with these removable plates, boom, and it clicks right in and then it locks. So then now I have a very easy way of moving this camera from this setup to the other one. Back and forth. I have its own dummy battery here. Our strip that I purchased, that's gonna be going probably on one side or the other. And I'm gonna have it so it mounts all the little USBs and powers all the different things in this little setup. And then just this one cable will go to an outlet. A five foot ethernet cable that plugs into obviously the computer so it's connected to the internet. And then I can run this to the nearest port in my house if we're doing the podcast here or the kitchen or the garage doesn't really matter. All I need to do is plug this and this into a wall and our ethernet and ready to go. We have to close out today's video early because we have a deadline to meet that we kind of messed up, you know? So we have to go figure out our way to- Create these three posts for them. Yeah, because we're not allowed to redo the content because it was live content. So now we have to figure out a way to make it seem like it was live and twist it a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little. All right, have a good day, everyone. Love you guys. We just realized Danny's shirt was inside out for this whole vlog. Look at this. Oh my God. I was blind when I put it on.